What up crew? I wanted to read a story called A Frog in the Bog, and this frog and the garden and the pond that it lives in reminds me of the work of Claude Monet and connects to our artwork. So let's see what this frog is doing in the bog. There's a frog on the log in the middle of the bog, a small green frog on a half sunk log in the middle of the bog. So there we see our frog on the log in the bog and there's some lily pads and flowers just like in Claude Monet's paintings and some reflections too. He flicks one tick as it creeps up a stick, one tick in the belly of a small green frog on a half sunk log in the middle of the bog. And the frog grows a little bit bigger. He sees two fleas as they leap through the reeds. One tick, two fleas in the belly of the frog on a half sunk log in the middle of the bog and the frog grows a little bit bigger. Hmm. So he keeps eating and gets bigger and bigger. He spies three flies as they buzz through the skies. One tick, two fleas, three flies, oh my, in the belly of the frog on a half-sunk log in the middle of the bog. Look at them all in there. So what's bigger? We got the flies, the uh, tick, and the fleas. I think they're getting bigger each time. And the frog grows a little bit bigger. He glugs four slugs as they sink through the sludge. Oh my. So we have one tick, two fleas, three flies, oh my, four slugs, ew, ugh, in the belly of the frog on a half sunk log in the middle of the bog. And the frog grows a little bit bigger. He inhales five snails from their heads to their tails. Yikes. So we have one tick, two fleas, three flies, oh my, four slugs, you ugh, and five slimy snails in the belly of the frog on a half sunk log in the middle of the bog. What a hog, that frog. It's getting crowded. And the frog grows a little bit bigger. Then, that log with the frog in the middle of the bog starts to rise, and the frog sees eyes. And the frog sees claws and a big set of jaws and a mouth like a crater. And the frog screams, Gator! That wasn't a log, it was an alligator. With his mouth open wide, all the bugs inside start to crawl and fly and slithered and slide. And out comes five snails from their heads to their tails. Four slugs, you ugh. Three flies, oh my. Two fleas, dear me, and one tiny tick, ick. And right in the middle of his holler, that frog grows a whole lot smaller. See you later, says the gator as he romps through the swamp, because the itty bitty frog isn't big enough to chomp. Now. The bugs in the bog keep away from the frog, and the frog never sits on a half-sunk log. So I guess they all learned their lesson, huh? Well, I like that book. It's a funny story, but I just like that the frog in the bog reminds me of the work of Claude Monet as well. So when you're working, maybe you want to add some of those slugs and bugs uh, and other critters, maybe even a gator. So keep up the good work. Adios amigos.